Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today let's take a look at The Lord of the Rings Return to Moria on the Steam Deck. This game just came out and it's actually a Epic Game Store exclusive. So yeah, I did manage to get it running on my Steam Deck. So let's take a look at it today. And if you're a fan of the channel, you probably noticed that I've been doing a lot of mods, cheats, trainers, stuff like that on the channel. And for this game, I've also been checking it out to see if there's any trainers available since it's so new. And to my surprise, um, there is one trainer actually working for it. Um, Cheat Happens, Aura. So if you have that, that's why I'm booting it up with Cheat Happens. Did you see the Steam Tinker launch? So if you don't know what I'm talking about, I have a uh, video showing you how to install this on your Steam Deck. But yeah, I'm not going to cheat on this game because it's a new game. I want to play through it. I heard it's a survival game and I love Lord of the Rings. So yeah, let's check it out. All right and see how it performs on the Steam Deck. And you also saw that uh, on my front page, on my home page, that I don't have any um, artwork for this game because it's not on Steam and it's so new. Uh, there's no artwork for it right now. So that's a bummer, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure someone will make it or maybe I'll make it. All right, so there, yeah, let's start. Okay, I think we can, uh, let me show you the cheats first if you're into that kind of stuff. So see here, I've got Cheat Happens Aura loaded with my game. So I can switch windows. So you need to be in, in developer mode. So in the uh, Steam Deck, you need to you need to uh, enable developer mode for, for you to switch windows. So I can switch to Cheat Happens Aura. And once I'm in here, I can type. So return, I've got a keyboard connected. Return to Moria. Okay, and I'm going to search all the games, not just recently used. Okay, The Law of the Rings Return to Morrow. See, this just came out today. Like the game, with the game. So I'm pretty surprised they've already got. So yeah, okay. Use Trainer. And then, see, game is found because I've got the game booted up. And then you just click Activate Trainer. I don't have um, the... Premium for cheat happens. I don't really use cheats a lot uh, So I don't really have it, but yeah, uh, you can if you want and if you don't have the premium Like a lot of these cheats you need to subscribe to unlock So these cheats super dwarf. I don't even know what that means because I haven't played the game invincible Unlimited durability stuff like that. Uh, if you're on the free version like me, you can only use the game speed So you can toggle the game speed I guess Okay Okay, yeah, you can toggle the game speed. I guess it makes it faster or you need to do more things. Oh, you can change the game speed here. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to do that right now. So I'm just going to turn it off just to let you know that uh, you've got a trainer already available. All right, let's play the game. This is my first time. Okay, so customize your dwarf. Okay, let's just keep it normal. Just keep it normal. Okay. And we go use the same, the first name. Yeah. Okay. Create world. Okay. All right. Is this an online game? I'm thinking this is like mostly played online. That's a bummer. I'm not really into online games. All right. So the frame rate right now is 30 on the cutscenes. Okay, let's skip this. I don't think you want to see cutscenes. You're probably more into the gameplay and see how it performs. Okay, so let me see. Oh, this game looks pretty good, actually. I'm, I kind of like the art style. All right, so it's a 30 frames right now. Okay, let me see if I can change that settings okay so video i'm gonna go for full screen resolution okay let's go to lower resolution frame rate of oh, 30 60 okay graphics okay let's go to low first see if we can get better better frame rate okay so it's b to save confirm okay return to game all right 
Oh yeah, cool. Oh, so we do get better frame rate. We're getting like 40-ish to 50. It's pretty good. Okay, uh, let me see my power tool settings. Uh, I've got SMT on, eight threads. Governor performance, frequency limits. I'm not gonna use frequency limits. Okay, I'll reapply the settings. Okay, and then uh, on my performance, yeah, I think I've just got. Okay, let's unlock frame rate. Okay, FSR on, scaling. Yeah, that's very basic. All right, so once I unlock the GPU limits, I'm getting 60 frames on low, on low settings. All right, let's see if we can do medium settings. Oh yeah, medium settings is good too. Medium. Okay, let's see. Let's see high. Okay, in high we're like getting like 50-ish. Alright. So Okay, let's change it back to medium. I think medium's the sweet spot for me right now. How about if I bump up the resolution a bit? Keep changes, confirm. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think this is good. This is good. Craft a torch. Okay, how do I get wood scrapes? How do I get that? Okay, punch. Wood scraps. Okay, this, I got it. How many do I need? And then craft. Call out. How do I craft? Craft a torch. Um, do I press on it? No. Nope. Did I miss the tutorial? Did I miss? Oh, no. Here, crafting. All right, craft. Cool. Okay. Actually, I might enjoy this game since I'm a lot of the Rings fan. And it runs pretty good, actually. Like, yeah, like these graphics are nice. Like, they don't have to be like super realistic. Like this cartoonish. Yeah, I like this game, this game style. All right. Too bad it's only on the Epic Game Store. Like, but I guess that's a financial decision. I guess like Epic paid them a lot of money to make it exclusive. But I just think if this game was on Steam, uh, it will probably get a lot more people playing it. Or I'm kind of stuck now. Where do I have to go? It's pretty hard to talk and play at the same time. All right, can I run? All right, you can run. All right, here's some. All right. And I'm not sure, is this like, I think you can play like other characters. I don't think you're only a dwarf. Is that, because I heard online, like you can create an elf and stuff. I'm not sure. Maybe. Okay, so where am I supposed to go? Down here. Oh, there's a, oh, there's some stutter right now when I just jump down here. Okay, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. All right, is this the starting place? This feels like the starting place. Yep. I don't know where to go. All right, maybe I'll figure it out off camera. So yeah, the game looks pretty good. And these are my settings. So uh, if you want to follow, my settings are for video. I'm doing full screen, uh, 1280 by 720. Frame rate limit is 60, VSync on, graphic quality medium, and then AMD FSR balanced. All right. And on my Steam Deck, I'm uh, power for the performance. I'm just doing... Um, 
yeah, unlimited frame rate, so frame rate limit off, and then scaling mode auto, scaling filter, FSR, FSR sharpness 5, and then power tools, power tools SMT on, 8 threads, and then governor performance, okay, and then nothing else, nothing else. And I have cryo utilities on, recommended settings, so swap in the 16, and I've also got um, my VRAM to 4 gigabytes, all right? So yeah, I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.